Today, you, me, and perfect boyfriend are impregnating the entire town. By the entire town, I mean not only the whole of Willow Creek, but I also want to do the whole of Oasis Springs too. I believe we have to make sure auto aging is on and we also enable neighborhood stories, I believe, and then that should do it. So we are not wasting any time at all. We are going into the BFF household. Summer holiday, you are going to be the first. Not that she's in interested she is just playing on her laptop i'm just going straight in with a flirt is she gonna reciprocate it we can already kiss her hands we've only just met is that even gonna be possible is she just letting me do it oh my god that that was too easy summer holiday you are not giving me any kind of chase at all i feel like this is starting off too easy we can already first kiss her this feels too easy like we've been recording for like less than two minutes and we're already doing it <laughs> Can we try for baby yet? I don't think we can. Do we need to be her boyfriend first or something? I don't think we do. There we go. Well, we can try for a baby in the shower. Let's get going, summer holiday. Now, I did Google it to double check. So apparently, if you make another sim pregnant as a male sim and the female sim is not in your household, she will still get pregnant and give birth. You'll just get a notification of it in the notification panel, which honestly, I have never, ever tried before in my entire life. Although, obviously, we don't know for a fact that they're pregnant because we can't go into the main household and double check. So I'm thinking if we just try for a baby with her multiple times, eventually it should work. And apparently there's an 80% chance of conception when you try for a baby. So if we woohoo three times with every sim, I feel like that's gonna be enough. So although that was lovely summer holiday, it's time to break up with you. I don't know where the, oh my God, order summer to clean. <laughs> that's so controversial. I wanna find find the interaction to break up with her but technically we're not actually in a relationship so no we're not so we don't even have to break up with her so that's always good liberty lee it's your turn is she gonna be as easy as summer holiday we'll soon find out i have given ourselves the romantic trait and the alluring trait so that sets us up for success she's already just taken it like she she loves it she's more than happy so already we're having the first kiss Kiss. And now we're going woohoo in the shower with her. This seems kind of dirty. We didn't wash the shower from when we were with Summer Holiday. Oh no, he's trying to woohoo with Summer Holiday. Oh no, stop. No, I didn't mean to woohoo with Summer Holiday. Leave, please. We need to be doing it with Liberty Lee. Okay, it's time. Try for a baby in the shower. And again, if we spam it three times, that should be enough to get them both pregnant, which will be fun. Two pregnant Sims in the same house. Uh, Travis Scott, did you just take a shit whilst we were woohooing in the shower? That is gross. I love how Perfect Boyfriend is now chatting with Summer Holiday. We need to get back with Liberty Lee, really. Try for a baby with Liberty Lee. We're going to bed this time so nobody disturbs us by having a poo. So I feel like now that's enough. Perfect Boyfriend, where did your hair go? Excuse me, where did your hair go? <laughs> Put your hair back on, please. Bloody hell. Well, that's two down. So now we've got to convince Eliza Pancakes to break up with Bob Pancakes so she can sleep with us because as far as, like, can NPCs cheat in The Sims 4? I'm not sure if it's really possible. Eliza's up playing chess by herself. I mean, we do have our romance up with her and she's accepting it to be fair. Oh, we can first kiss already. White whilst Bob Pancakes is downstairs not knowing any better. I mean, they're basically separated anyway. And now we can actually have our first kiss whilst Bob is here. Oh my God, that's so savage. Should we woohoo in Bob's bed even? That's very savage. That's very savage indeed. Shall we embrace a new personality trait non-committal? I think we should. And then why did, why did I get sparks coming out of me? I hope she didn't make me pregnant. <laughs> okay, also we need to like change our outfit in a mirror because I can't stand that my hair keeps coming off every single time. I, I think it's the pajamas. I don't know where the hair was going. So now I think we're done. I love how we've got our first woohoo mootlet. I think we've done more than a first woohoo. Although it says we're embarrassed because we've been caught with another cheating. I guess that was with Summer Holiday maybe and the other one, Liberty Lee. Bob Pancakes is absolutely oblivious. 
to the fact that we're getting off with Eliza. Maybe he likes it. Maybe he's a watcher. So, oh gosh, it's 2 a.m. We better get home. As you can see, we're very happy. I wonder why. Luckily, Sims in The Sims 4 don't have to pay child tax support. Otherwise, we'd be screwed. Summer holiday. Hey, I heard you became friends with Eliza Pancake. She's pretty cool. I think Summer Holiday's catching on. I think she's the first bunny boiler. So we do have the Simder dating app mod installed. So we could look for a specific date. Oh, Liberty Lee's calling me. Nope, sorry. I've got another girl. To begin with, I just want to start off with Sims in Willow Creek and Oasis Springs. Katrina Caliente. Seeing me, she lives in Oasis Springs. Let's go to Rattlesnakes. Oh gosh, look how formally she's dressed up. Oh no, I'm only casual. Okay, there we go. We're in a suit now. She's gone off without me, of course. Oh gosh, I should have known. Sims for Townie AI is so bad. Oh gosh, and of course the celebrities turned up. Of course the fan is passing out. Of course, of course. It wouldn't be any other way. It literally would not be any other way. No, it wouldn't. Oh my God. The Sims 4 makes me rage. It literally makes me rage. I hate it. I hate townies. I hate them all. This is why everybody just builds in the game. This is why nobody plays it anymore. Tell me right now, this isn't the most romantic date you've ever seen in your entire life. Okay, well, we've basically completed the date event anyway. So I'm going to end the event now and take her back to my place maybe or maybe we should go to her place and now whilst we're trying for a baby with uh, oh excuse me who's got a baby here dina dina caliente's already got a baby apparently <laughs> where did that baby come from neighborhood stories are so lethal like if you turn them on every single sim is either adopting a baby or having a baby naturally <laughs> well with katrina out the way we may as well move on to dina i mean isn't dina the daughter of katrina caliente so if they both have a baby to me what is their familial like relation does that mean katrina would be the sibling and the grandmother of the baby at the same time <laughs> something like that anyway if she's had a baby with don i'm so sorry sir but uh we are using dina caliente now for another baby so i like how i'm still in my pajamas i feel like flirting for me is just too easy and i don't know why i am asking her if she's single oh she is single maybe it's not her baby i'm not too sure what's happened there anyway try for a baby Liberty Lee, I don't want to pass moral judgments, but I heard you were caught cheating on your partner. You should try and keep your private affairs more private. I don't think anything could be any less private than woohooing every single sim in the world. Oh, look, she's she's taking a wee right next to me. Lovely. So Nina Caliente is the next one. So we've got Nina out the way now. It says we can't try for a baby again. It says this sim's household is too big. What do, wait, what does that mean? They've got four sims in the household so far, including the baby. So if we impregnate one, pregnate another, pregnate another, that's only seven. So I don't know why it's saying there's too many Sims. That sounds like a glitch unless I'm mistaken. I'm just going to have to evict somebody. Right, Don Lothario, you can move to Mount Komarebi with this random family. Can we make them? There we go. We can try for a baby now properly. Or maybe that meant somebody was pregnant with either twins or triplets. And that's why it was too much. That would be interesting to see. So I'm on the Sim to Data app and I've selected the one night stand feature. There's so many townies. I can't actually remember which are in the base game world. Zoe Patel, is she one? I feel like she might be. So we've invited her over for a hookup call using Simda Dating. I can't believe like it just says order Zoe to clean. Like surely that's not a thing. How is that a thing? I like how we've got all these milestones that we've fallen in love with all these Sims. Have we really fallen in love with all these Sims? Now, I haven't forgotten about Bella Goth. Do you guys want to know something so crazy? When you enable neighborhood stories, if you have horse ranch, the Goth household will always get a horse. I don't know why, but the Goth household will always get a horse if you enable neighborhood stories. <laughs> and it's just so dumb. Anyway, it's what it is. Bella Goth wants to already first kiss. That was very quick and easy. She is not holding back. For some reason, I thought she would be the toughest one, but she's not tough at all. The kids are in the next room. This is very scandalous indeed. 
indeed. We've got one more household in Willow Creek, which is a Spencer Kim Lewis household. As far as I'm aware, you cannot get elders pregnant. So there's only one member of the household who we can do it with. Here she is. Love how her husband just walks past like nothing's happening. Like this challenge would not be possible in The Sims 2. I'm telling you now, if this happened in The Sims 2, how would break loose? We're literally woohooing in the shower next to her mother. Like nothing's going on. Like this would never happen in The Sims 2. But in The Sims 4, it's very easy. Vivian, on that note, could you leave please, Vivian? We try. Oh, the kids turned up. As oh, for Christ's sake. Right, get back in the shower. So see me that Sims pregnancy takes three days usually. Plus you've got the conception day. So I, I guess technically it's four days. We should be receiving a baby within the next couple days. Our family tree is empty right now. We've got one more household in Oasis Springs, which is Langrab. We're doing it right in front of our husband, Joffrey Langrab. Not that he cares. Not that any Sims 4 town he seems to care. And sir, may I say, I love your randomly generated outfit, sir. You look absolutely stunning. I can see why she's cheating on you. It says perfect boyfriend has identified a new type of fish from Nancy Langrab. What kind of flirty conversation could you possibly have which involves fish? Oh, Nancy Langrab is so smitten with perfect boyfriend. She's proposing marriage. That's lovely, but no, thank you. I, I just want a child, please. Let's get back to woohooing. Eliza Pancakes is calling. Eliza, what do you want? Okay, sh she's just saying stuff about a hot dog. She she must she must want my hot dog back. <laughs> She wants more. No, guys, I can't get over Joffrey Langrab's randomly generated outfit. Like, what's going on? Although we haven't got a baby yet, which is a little bit confusing. Do you know what I'm going to do? We're going into Manage Worlds and we're doing a pregnancy test on all these Sims. Oh, well, we don't need to do one for Liberty Lee. That one's quite obvious. Summer holiday. Oh, that one's quite obvious too. The first Caliente is pregnant. So is the second one. So is the third. Oh my God, it's worked. We've just got to wait for them to give birth now. So do you know what? I'm gonna do okay i'm just gonna fill our needs oh katrina caliente's calling oh it's nothing to do with the baby i'll ignore it i am going to disable our need decay i'm just gonna speed time up and just there we go we can watch some tv and i'm just gonna wait in speed three and see what happens it's happening nancy langrab is so smitten by perfect boyfriend she's proposing i already said no the first time and um, what gave you permission to just walk in my house without asking nancy langrab grab oh my god you stalk her what are you doing in my house i didn't invite you in get out please get out of my house you stalker <laughs> eliza's asking me for a date oh no this is all catching up on me i believe on the mailbox we can click check neighborhood stories there clara bergson has died she slipped when rock climbing that's so lovely but there's no news of a baby in the town yet saying that i've looked at our genealogy we've got a baby summer holiday had a baby isn't that lovely summer holiday we got our first and it's called Erin. One down, many more to go. And um, oh, for Christ's sake, Daddy Fladdy's turned up. Sir, please, I'm just trying to sleep. Sir, I'm just trying to sleep. Gosh, I think this was my karma, wasn't it? Anyway, looks like someone else has given birth. Alexandra Lee, Liberty Lee's had a baby. Lovely. They're all popping out now. So in our relationship panel, it seems there are 10 babies. <laughs> 10. So I've just installed MC Command Center. So we can have more than eight sims in the household. I think you know what that means. It means we're having all of the kids, which seems only fair that we have them all, seeing that it basically was our fault to begin with. In order to add extras into the household, though, we do need to age a couple of them up in order to make MC Command Center work, because you can only add a maximum of eight sims from managed households. In order for the cheat to work, you actually have to go into the household and shift click them and then click add to family. I love how the way we're holding our babies, they're just kind of clipping through each other. Do you know what? I've never seen a sim actually use this like backpack thing for the kids. I've genuinely, it comes with growing together, but I've genuinely never ever seen it before in game. This is the first time I've seen it. Wonder what's going to happen when we get a third to come with us. What happens? Oh, one of, one of them just chucked on the floor. Anyways, here's all of our screaming kids from both Oasis Springs and Willow Creek. Aren't we just going to have the most wonderful life together? <laughs>
I can't imagine all of the glitches of having 10 infants in your household. Even one is enough, <laughs> let alone 10. Well, here we go, guys. The plan was a success. If you would like to see me impregnate literally the entire world in the game, then let me know and I will impregnate every single sim from every other world. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you in the next one.